Coming up in just a few minutes. Tony. Thank you, Brady. This is new at noon. A lawsuit was filed claiming deputies in Colorado failed to pick up on signs of human trafficking and tased a potential victim when she was 16 years old. And I apologize, I don't know if this is the right video tied to that. There we go. So this lawsuit, it stems from an incident in January of 2022 when the teen reportedly ran away from home. This is body camera video from that day. The lawsuit states that the teen was found in a trailer in Westcliff with two men. One of them was in his 50s. And according to the law firm, he had an outstanding warrant for his arrest. The lawsuit claims the deputies ignored the men and took the teen girl into custody while she was intoxicated. The teen was allegedly drugged to a patrol car and then tased even though she was handcuffed. One of the lawyers representing the potential victim, Tyler Jolly, with Jolly Law says, quote, this kind of treatment would be excessive against a hardened criminal. To treat a 16-year-old child and the victim of a sex crime like this is absolutely disgusting, end quote. Four deputies were named in the lawsuit. I did reach out to the Custer County Sheriff, and I'm waiting to hear back. Expect more coverage on this case on KKTV throughout the day. This is new today, a preliminary hearing for the man accused of driving his car through the Pueblo Mall, along with making bomb threats, has been...